Hi, my name is Casey Bridgewater. I am the Training and Safety Supervisor for Wilson Logistics out of our Missoula Terminal. Um, today, I am going to give you a brief demonstration on how to send your E-Rods, as well as give you some helpful pointers that can help you along the way. To help you kind of guide your way through um, any questions you might have with really anything on your Omnitrax, honestly, it's a good thing to kind of flip through. So it might be something for anyone to really look at is this right tab here. You can kind of shift over to the next screen and in the bottom right corner, you'll see driver training. Click on that guy. And then you're gonna look, you can choose whichever language you want, obviously. Um, and then there's multiple things you can look at here. There's messaging, you know, hours of service, ways to do your vehicle inspections, basically anything that you have in here that you guys might have questions on, this little thing will answer it for you. you keep clicking through, there's other things on here as well. The one that'll be super helpful for you at this time is uh, the hours of service one. So if you click on that hours of service, it gives you an hours of service overview, um, basically tells you all the information you might need um, on either stuff and gives you just basic instruction on pretty much everything you can look for. Um, you can go through all these tabs here and it actually shows you how to uh, certify your logs. It shows you how to um, um, send your E-Rods, everything that we kind of just talked about, which is very, very helpful. I recommend that everybody kind of flip through it and really familiarize yourself with your Omnitrax unit. Hi, this is a short uh, video on how to send your E-Rods to a, an inspecting officer. And first off, you have to do is just go into hours. You want to go into your day log by touching it. Touch your E-Rod. You want to go fax or email, whichever one it is, web service or email. The officer will give you that direction. And then you hit send. If there's any comments, you need to add those. Come on. Hit the send button. You get the OK that says it's in being processed. Tell it OK. In a few minutes, you will get confirmation that it has been sent. There it is. Bye. All right. And lastly, um, every driver should already have a driver's daily log. Um, so paper logs on your truck regardless. Um, but these ones specifically are super helpful. Uh, for one, they have tons and tons of them, so you can flip through and it's really easy to keep track of everything. Um, but in the back of all these books, there's a little kind of cheat sheet for you to use where it actually kind of refers to everything you might possibly need uh, to certify your logs here in the back. Um, specific to each unit that you might have, um, gives you really just everything you might need to know. Um, and actually shows you how to send in your E-Rods and all that stuff as well. Uh, if you don't have these books, make sure that you get with any one of your training departments or safety departments and make sure they get one of these log books for you. Uh, super helpful to have and obviously you need to have one on the truck anyway. So definitely reach out to your safety or training departments for any of this information you might need.